the pros do and go where the pros go. Celebrate Juneteenth. Go to blackartsandideasfest.com. We're going to raise a toast and say happy anniversary to Hutton and Smith this morning. They celebrate nine years here in the area. Melanie Krautstrunk is here to celebrate their ninth anniversary and let us know how we are also invited to the party. So great to see you. Oh, thank you so much for having me. Um, we're happy to celebrate nine years in Chattanooga. Yeah. Um, this year we're doing something new that we haven't done before and that's we're doing a fundraiser for McKamey. We created um, two beers um, that are going to be cats versus dogs. So from 12 to 2 you can come and make your um, selection if you want cats versus dogs. McKamey will be selling these and then the first one to sell out will be the winner. So she and I were having this conversation before we got on air about the sense of community that's here in Chattanooga. Mm -hmm. Y'all moved here about 11 years ago, um, twice that and then some. Um, but it really is a place where you can quickly get involved and make a difference in any way that you choose. So I think it's really fun yeah, that well, y'all have chosen we're this. we're animal people also. Yeah. Which would you choose, cats or dogs? Well, I don't know. I have both at my house. Oh. <laughs> but I think I would probably go cat. Okay. Well, good choice. Really? Yeah. So this is, is the green one the cat? Um, is it the the uh, aunt? pink one is okay. the cat, and then the blue one is dogs. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let's talk a little bit about the day because on June 22nd it is intended to be for the whole community so yes. this is all ages the adoption part from McKamey is mm -hmm. 12 to 2 yes um, and then you'll find out who the winner is yes and then uh, from 2:45 to 10 we're gonna have live music so we're gonna start um, with um, uh, we there be monsters and then the banshees and then iron fuzz and then our headliner is going to be we are us okay so we'll have live music all day but the event will be all ages all day and we'll also have um eight beer releases including five can releases i brought three um here today that we have ready so we're still working on two more for the party so back to that sense of community at hutton and smith it's very mm -hmm. much a family so mm -hmm. these beers that you're releasing have been designed by your staff is that right that's right so two of these um a uh, chill brown ale, that's Chris Hill. He works for us. He's one of our brewery assistants. And um, he designed this beer with uh, Matt Warren. Um, actually. Uh, oh, with Matt Warren? Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, and his wife works here at the yes. studio. And then um, Savannah is one of our um, bartenders, and she designed the artwork for her label. And um, her and our brewer, um, her now brother in law, um, signed this. His name is Jacob Nosley. And then the Baja Light was designed by um, my husband. He's our master brewer. And um, one of his friends that we lived with in Vegas that he used to homebrew with years ago has moved back and they collaborated on this one. So this is salt and lime lager. It's really delicious. It's 4.7%. It's going to be drinking it great is a, all summer. It's a vocabulary that I don't know well. Okay. <laughs> um, because, but there are, I mean, just the fact that they can have these new eight releases. If you are a beer maker, you really get into the different nuances of the beer and how you compare one thing with a burger and mm -hmm. one thing with some chicken on the grill. Yeah. Um, so it's so when you get your ticket for the event, mm -hmm. uh, it's thirteen dollars pre-sale, fifteen at the day of. That's right. And you get your first beer for free. You get a commemorative cup. You get a raffle ticket, and then of course live music and games all day. So okay. it's going to be a fun day. And I, you know, just for the sake of, obviously, you're going to want people to be very responsible while they are there. This is not intended course, to be yes, a fest, right? Yes, yes. Get a ride home if you need to and monitor yourself when you're there. We'll have water stations set up so um, everybody can have a safe, fun day. It's like for these that you have here for the dogs and the cats, first of all, when the event is over, can we still purchase these? Yes, if there's any left. <laughs> but like, but, but when they the all event sell out, is over, mm -hmm. is that, that's just it? It's gone? If we have any left at the end of the day, they'll be available in the tap room okay for sale but you mm -hmm. won't continue to brew them no mm -hmm. okay the one-time thing the mm -hmm. one-time thing mm -hmm. and how long does it take you to create something like that uh, a beer typically takes um, two to three weeks to to ferment and get to the point where it's available to the package and then we do the artwork in-house so um, uh, I can say about three weeks okay. to get a new well beer that's very out. impressive yeah thank you that yeah. you could do all that so okay we're gonna be rooting for the cats but you got to get some okay. for the dogs too, I All guess. All right. Thank you very much. Great to see you mm -hmm. this morning. And thanks for doing the outreach to help McKamey. Yeah. So June 22nd, the place to be is at Hutton and Smith down there on Martin Luther King. You can learn more at huttonandsmithbrewing.com. And can they get their ticket there too as well? Uh, no, in the tap room. Oh, in the tap room. Yep. Very good. Okay. Happy anniversary. Thank you. Thank you. 
Tickets for the St. Jude Dream Home are almost sold out. Get your ticket now for this gorgeous three-bedroom and three-and-a-half bath home. If you don't call or go online now to reserve your ticket, you'll miss your chance.